Well, this really was the announcement heard around the world, trending globally on Twitter all day. Monarchists and British expatriates, even folks who normally don't pay too much attention to the royal family, are having their say. CTV Stephanie Sherlock joins us now with more of the reaction. Stephanie. Well, Hudson, it's no secret here on Vancouver Island, we love our royals. And while Kate is getting the rest and care that she needs, throughout the Commonwealth, people are celebrating. She brought glamour back to the monarchy. And now, just a year and a half into her marriage to Prince William, Kate is giving it an air. Uh, it's an important thing for the monarchy to have the continuity of the generations. That's, that's kind of the point. The joyous news hit the airwaves and royal lovers started talking. I turned on the BBC news and that's when I heard it. So I think it's great. Do you have a message that you would send to Will and Kate regarding their baby? Congratulations. I hope everything goes real well. Monarchists and British expats alike are excited at the prospect of a new royal to watch. I think they make great, yeah, great parents. Yeah, after Diane, I think they've, you know, following her footsteps, I think they'll be just great. I'm sure that there will be many, many millions of well-wishers around the Commonwealth sending in notices and, and gifts for, uh, for the new baby who will likely be our monarch one day in the distant future. And just what kind of gift do you get a royal mum and babe? Well, there's designer diaper bags and heirloom quality prams, but... She's proven herself to be already a style icon, so I chose what's called the mini fashionista. This is an organic onesie. Perfect things for a woman whose every outfit is closely scrutinized. And it's just really, really delightful, and I could imagine a little princess wearing this very easily. Perfect for a future queen or king. I'm pulling for a boy, I think. I'm feeling girl. You mm -hmm. notice how I picked a lot of princessy things out? Mm -hmm. I'm very much feeling a girl. Whatever the gender, the royal baby is sure to capture global interest. Like any birth in, in my family, it'll be a time for celebration and it'll be a happy day. If you could send them a message regarding their current state, what would it be? Try and keep your privacy. It's going to be the real challenge, I think, is going to be really keeping their privacy already. Today, a Twitter account was set up for the royal fetus. And if you can believe it, more than 7,500 followers just in one day. And of course, the next step is going to be talking about names. We're going to be guessing those things. We know George is being bandied about for a boy. Victoria, obviously, for a girl, which would certainly make us all very happy. But, you know, I think that Prince Hudson has a pretty nice ring to it, too. I don't know about that. Sounds a little regal, don't you think? Uh, and if they're already talking about baby clothes, imagine the, the trends she'll set with uh, her maternity wear. It's definitely going to be something to keep us all very entertained for the next at least seven or eight months. Well, it's exciting news and we wish them well. Steph, thank you. You're welcome.